consider cheating, Danny, if a partner goes to a strip club? What do you reckon? Everyone can have a different opinion. I don't think it's cheating. You know, if you're just having a look. I agree. It's not cheating in my mind. I agree. Uh, there's a lot of people, uh, well, mainly women, uh, guys might have a problem with it as well, you know, if their girls went to like a, a male strippers, but I don't think it's quite common. But, you know, a lot of women do have a problem with guys going to the strip clubs, and I don't think they should worry uh, a hell of a lot, because you go to a strip club, you know, the likelihood of picking up a stripper is next to none, okay? So... They're professional, they've got a job to do, they only care about money, they'll say hi to you, they'll get to know you, but it's business. It's just you go there and have a great time. Uh, they don't let you touch. You know, uh, a lot of times we can. Uh, I don't recommend touching or doing anything else very sexual if you have a partner. But going there, having a drink with the boys, chit-chatting, having a couple girls come up to you, I don't think there's nothing wrong with that. Um, Lap dances when you're taken, okay, I draw the line there, I draw the line there, but if you just go into a strip club, you see a couple chicks, they might even sit on your lap, you know, and you're out there with the boys, I don't see anything wrong with that, but that's just me. So if you had a, a, a partner, would you get a lap dance? Honestly, man, if I had a partner, no, I would not, I would not go for a lap dance, but I would still go to the strippers, I would still interact with the women there. Uh, I don't see anything wrong with it, Danny. Um, look, if it, some people ask me, all right, if your girl went to a, a male stripper night with a bunch of her girlfriends, would you get upset? Fuck no, I wouldn't I would care. I would not care. In fact, I'd joke around, I'd ask, hey, was he bigger than me? You know, I, I, I'm funny like that, man. I don't know. Look, I agree. Call, call I agree. Me weird, but I'm, I know. think on a guy's night out, you can go have a few yeah. drinks, have a talk. You just see just looking, but, you know, you've got no intent on doing anything, you're not touching, no lap dances, I agree. The only one possible problem could be if she doesn't know you're there. As long as your partner knows you're there, exactly. you're not going behind her back. Exactly, mate. I always say that. Look, a lot of people deem cheating in all sorts of different ways. I don't see anything as cheating, okay, if the partner is cool with it, if the partner knows. If you're going behind her back, even if you're going to these places, strip clubs, and she doesn't know you're there, and you tell, oh, I'm just at the pub with the mates having a late one, we're kicking it, you know, till all hours of the night, and, you know, you're, you're completely somewhere else. That is wrong. As far as I'm concerned, that is some sort of cheating because you are fucking lying to your girl. You know what you're doing is wrong, you know, the way that you're doing it. Oh, look, cheating per se, I don't know, but that's definitely wrong, and there's there should be a serious problem with that uh, at home. Oh, there it is. I yeah. never lie to girls, man. You know me, Danny. You've known me yep. all my life. We grew up together, and I am a fucking man's man. I respect women. I love women. I'm honest. If I had a girl, I'll tell her, look, there might be uh, a stage every now and then. It wouldn't be often, but there'd be stages where I'd go to the strippers. I'd end up there on the way back from somewhere else, you know, with mates. We'd, we'd you know, cruise there, you know, we'd stop off, we'd get inside. I would let her know where we've gone, okay? And if naked chicks just came up and sat next to us or sat on our laps, I'd tell her. I'd be foolish to go for a lap dance. Uh, but um, look, if a mate shouted me a lap dance or go in, which is very rare, who the fuck's going to shout a lap dance? But it does happen. You now, if I went in there, you know, didn't re she didn't really get naked. I told her my situation. But we chat. She does, you know, she, you know, she comes up close to me. She gets nice and warm with me. I, don't, I just don't consider it cheating. I mean, if you're going to a brothel, uh, which we'll discuss in another video, uh, because believe it or not, that can be a bit of a grey area. It's Sometimes there's not a right or wrong there, I know, as crazy as that sounds. Uh, but in this case, I just don't see it cheating at, at all, man. Like, as long as it, you don't go to a brothel, which is the common place to go to cheat, I don't see strip club as cheating in, in, in any way, shape, or form, Danny. I agree, and... At the end of the day, if you have to lie to your partner about your whereabouts, then your relationship uh, isn't as solid as you may think it is. That's right. If you can't be honest with your partner and say, look, hun, i I'm going to a strip club tonight because the boys want me to tag along. You know, it could be true. Maybe the boys do. Even if you really want to just go, you can say, look, I'm going with the boys. They want me there. That's not a lie. You, you know, it's okay if you just... You know, tell them in a non, you know, like, you know, don't be insensitive, 
you know, break it to them, you know, like you have a game with the boys. Don't just say, yeah, I feel like seeing some uh, naked women tonight. I'm not going to go in, but I really do want to see some naked women, babe. It's just, you know, seeing the same tits all the time. No, you can't be a fucking moron. You can't be an insensitive prick. You can't be a dickhead. But your wife, or whether it be your fiancé or your girlfriend, you know, your partner, she will understand if you just want to go and let loose with a couple of boys at a strip joint. It, it, I don't see it as a... Look, it might be a little bit on the... Um, it'll, I don't even know if you call it emotional cheating. It, it's, it's definitely not physical cheating. Okay, but yeah, you're going there, you know, your intentions are to get fucking turned on by other sexy women there. Whether you're going privately inside or not, you know, you're there. And um, look, I just don't see a problem with it. Look, maybe other people on Facebook can comment below and let us know. I personally don't have a problem with it. I mean, yeah, I mean, you're the same. Yeah, Danny, you, you don't see an issue yeah, with that? I, I agree. And, and I even think that, you know, if, you know, looking at it from the woman's perspective, if she's sneaking, gee, my husband's out with the guys, there's more likely of him cheating at a bar or a nightclub than a strip club. That's right. How do you cheat at a strip club? That's what I mean. Women, I, I don't want to, I'm going to get hit for this, but it's true. Women can be very ignorant because, you know, they just crack the shits when men go to these places. They're almost ready to hang up, to hang it up and just say, it's over. That is a crock of shit. Look, and I'm not a hypocrite. I'd let my girl go to a male strippers, you know, or she can have hens nights three, four times a year. She can have a lot of friends, you know, a lot of them are getting, you know, engaged and, you know, married off. They can do all that stuff. But for a guy to not be able to do that, some women are so fucking stupid, Danny, that there could be a guy looking through a Zoo, Zoo Weekly magazine, looking at girls from there, and the girl just slams the door, goes in the room, locks the door, and just doesn't talk to them for the rest of the night. You know, that's... Dude, it is the epitome of fucking stupidity. Honestly, man. Like, you don't get jealous from a magazine. You don't get jealous if a guy says, oh, she's nice on the TV, and the woman's like, what? You know, she just storms off. You don't get jealous if you're at a beach and, you know, you're looking at a few other girls. You're not fucking going to go with them, man. I always say, I always say this, and girls can do this with guys too, even if I'm with the chick. Just because you're on a fucking diet does not mean you cannot look at the menu. And I've always said that, man, and sometimes I sound like an arrogant cunt, you know, but a lot of people understand, Danny. Well, I think um, and what it boils down to a lot of times is if there isn't trust. If, if You know, if you let your woman know that you love her, you care about her, that, you know, she's beautiful in your eyes, then she's not going to care if you do know she'll call. If you just happen a woman, you know, you glance, you know, because, you know, you have eyes. You don't look in a sleazy way. You're not going to turn your head. But if something if it happens to, you know, cross your path, she knows that, you know, you're not going to be thinking about leaving her for the other girl. It's all about making her feel important. And she has to know that you are a gentleman because... The, yeah. the way I see it, Danny, you're exactly right. And the way I see it, Danny, you know... And you're allowed to look, okay? You are allowed to look. And strip club, you go there to look. And if a woman is not going to allow their man to go and do that, okay, with a, a group of boys, then he really needs to put her in line or he just needs to leave. I mean, we're not saying women should be placed in line, but get your fucking stuff and fuck off because if, if a woman's going to treat you like that, if you can't go and enjoy a nice night at the strip club, I'm not saying do it every so often. Once a fucking blue moon, if you can't go to a strip club and your woman has a problem with that, Fucking just cut her loose because she's only going to do your fucking head in. If she's going to get upset over that, you can only imagine what stuff she'll get upset with in just everyday life. Well, I think if, if that situation happens and you have to ask her the question, go, well, if you don't trust me, do you think that I'm going there looking to cheat? Because she must have a low opinion of you. If she thinks that you just, you know, you see an attractive woman, you're going to immediately try to flirt. Spot on, Danny. That is spot on, mate. If, you know, if she has a problem with you going to a place like this, and it really gets, uh, we're going to talk about this another time, it's a slightly different topic, but just in general, you go somewhere where there's a couple of girls and they get suspicious, like a lot, man. Like they almost get in their car and they come down and meet you there. It's like, oh yeah, I'm just around the corner. Yeah, but I thought you were staying home, you know. They like to spy on you. Why are women like that? Uh, look, guys are like that as well. I know a lot of guys that are very obsessive. They always want to make sure where the women are. Uh, it's vice versa, guys. But in regards to strip clubs, which is a common thing for men, if women are not going to let their men go, okay, if men are honest and tell them and they crack the shits and, you know, tell them, you know, oh, what the fuck are you doing, this and that, 
I just don't think that's right. I think they should be able to go to a strip club, and that's that.